Good morning, Hayyem Yem, Chavtes Ir, the 44th day of the Emer. So today's Hayyem Yem is taken from a letter of the Friedrich Rebbe that he wrote to a Bachar who had left, who had traveled to Israel. And the Rebbe wrote to him how he worries about him, he's concerned about him. And then he told him the contents of another Hayyem Yem entry, the entry of Chav Hei Sivan, where he told him that it's imperative and it's important that he shares his challenges, he shares his struggles with other people. He shouldn't keep everything bottled up. Bottled up, and he should share it with his friends and with him, the Friedrich Rebbe. And he, the Friedrich Rebbe, will then intercede and pray by the other Abayim, by the previous Chabad Rebbe, and they will bless and they will help this person, this Bachar. They will help you. And then he proceeded to tell him that Tzadikim, no matter where they go, no matter what they're doing, even after they pass, they are mindful of and they are thinking about and they are advocating for their followers, for the people they care about. And then he proceeded to tell him the contents of today's Yim Yim, that every single Jew, no matter who you are, every single soul, is constantly getting stronger. It's constantly building its spiritual muscles, which results in it building its influence on the world. And he said, every single day when we pray, three times a day, our prayers are like a spiritual workout. Our spiritual muscles are getting stronger, which means our power on the world, our influence on the world, is constantly rising, is constantly getting stronger. And he said, if every Jew is constantly getting stronger, if every Jew's influence on the world is constantly increasing, then how much more so Sadiqim's influence, Sadiqim's spiritual strength, Sadiqim's influence on the world is constantly rising, is constantly on the rise. Because there is a pasuk, there is a verse that says, Yelchu Mikhail Ochayel. You should go from strength to strength. You should constantly get stronger, you should constantly reach new highs, you should constantly reach new peaks. And our sages tell us, Chazal tell us, that after Sadiqim passed away, they don't go on vacation, they don't rest, they don't go to heaven and play harps all day, but they are constantly moving. They never rest. And they apply to them this Pasuk, Yelcha Mikhail Ochel, and they say Tzadikim are constantly rising, constantly getting stronger, constantly building their influence on the world. And he said there's no question that Tzadikim use this great influence, they use their great spiritual power to intercede and look out for their followers, for their chassidim, for you. And he said more specifically, the ones they look out for are people that are connected to them and their teachings, who follow their teachings, and more specifically, they look out for their students and their student students. And basically what I think the Friedrich Rebbe is saying is I am the student of the previous Rebbe, I am the child of the pre previous Rebbe, and you are my student, you are my child. So the previous Rebbe are going to look out for you. And they will look out for you in all areas of your life, physically and spiritually. They will look out for you medically, financially, emotionally, mentally, spiritually, in all areas of your life. They care about you, they are thinking about you, they are looking out for you. Have a wonderful, wonderful day.